I mean, it's been a while. It has indeed been a while. And uh, welcome back to another video, guys. As you can see, we are back on Madfoot. We have absolutely nothing right now. But um, today I'm here mainly to discuss if we're going to have a Madfoot 22 or not. And if we do, when are we going to have it? Because as you guys know, we did face a few issues. The SBC stopped the last proper SBC. I think, wait, have they just taken out all of the SBCs? Yeah, I think they've expired or they've taken them out or whatever, they've done something. And as you guys know, they stopped making SBCs after I think that Premier League Player of the Month, Ihia Nacho SBC. I think that was the last SBC that they did ever release, the La Liga Player of the Month, Benzema, that set of SBCs. Since then, they have been releasing SBCs in objectives. But even that stopped after, I think the last person with SBCs was Steven Gerrard? Yes, there you go. Steven Gerrard did have SBCs. Edgar Davies had SBCs as well, but they were Edgar Davies, um, they were league SBCs. And uh, Cafu did not have any SBCs whatsoever. So first up, uh, the rumors going around that the SBCs were stopped because of another copyright issue for Madfoot, which meant like, they had to hide their SBCs in objectives. And then uh, people were starting to speculate as to uh, whether or not, you know, um, we're gonna have a Madfoot 22. And then this started happening where they stopped the SBCs altogether, as I've already mentioned, no SBCs even in the objectives. But then they started releasing new lightning rounds with new packs and all that stuff. And uh, that, again, <laughs> changed everyone's perception. Yeah, perceptions have been changing a lot. But um, in the end, uh, you know, to sum things up, uh, people do believe, and a lot of YouTubers believe, and a lot actually, um, PaceyBits21, a YouTuber who does have contact with the devs, has pretty much confirmed that Madfoot22 will be coming out. Um, he is not sure if it's going to be with the same name or not, but it will be coming out around the same time as the first one did. And if we see, uh, Madfoot21 did come out around, um, where is it? October 11th of 2020, so pretty much. I think uh, a week or two from now we should be expecting Madfoot 22, two weeks uh, would sound more reasonable, um, you know, uh, it does come out earlier on iOS than Google uh, because of the Play Store issues and stuff, you know how uh, Google do tend to take their time to review the game and everything, so uh, that's the Madfoot news, so we can expect a Madfoot 22 in the first, you know, couple of weeks of October. Um, and uh, yeah, that is it, um, but there is still a slightest of chance that you may not see a map for 22, but you don't need to worry about it, and I say this because there are quite a few other things that you need to know about other games that I'm going to tell you right now. Next up, here's the news on Pac-Win 22. They did tell me they will give me an official release date uh, soon. But for now, this is what we're going to make do with uh, when we have the official release date. I will make another video. But as you can see, um, they're going to release new details in these stories. And as you can see, first off, they are making a new game platform. And uh, they're doing this. I'm going to sum it up. You don't need to read the whole thing. Um, so, they're, so they're doing this to add new tools and uh, develop something more interesting and stuff. So uh, they further elaborated this on the next stories that means they are going to be making the game from scratch um, but that does mean it's going to need more time but they did start developing this earlier so regarding the date of release that does mean it's going to be pretty much um, you know late October to early November as you can see right here uh, more information will be released about the date of release and if we check when it was released uh, last year we will just see real quick um, as you can see, pretty much around the same time, early November, 7th November 2020, so it should be pretty much at the same time. So don't don't keep your hopes up for late October, just, just go with the feeling that it's going to be in early November. And then um, the redesigned squad building, they've added quite a few new features, so basically they are fixing drafts and they're fixing the thing where you can put any player in any position uh, in SBCs and drafts which is going to be really helpful and they're 
fixing that and then uh, they did say they're gonna there's gonna be uh, more news in the few in the future days in the f further days i can't speak english right now but in the near future they're gonna be giving us more news so along with this news and uh, you know the confirmed uh, release date i'll be making another video on pacwin 22 as well real soon and now let's go ahead and cover pack opener for foot 22 so the situation with pack opener for foot 22 um as you can see it is going to be released at the beginning of october so as you can see it is going to be released at the beginning of october so we didn't need uh, much research over there so as you can see pack opener for foot 21 was released on 2nd october 2020 so i would say the first week of october the beginning of october uh you don't i'm hoping we won't need to wait till the second week of october for pack opener for foot 22 so pack opener for foot 22 is pretty self-explanatory uh, nothing much going on over there we will maybe make one last um, pack opener for foot secret codes and uh, regular codes video so look out for that as well and uh, yeah I think uh, not much um, on this side of things so now let's move on to the final two games that I wanted to cover news on okay here is something really really exciting as you can see foot dit 22 these guys are looking to take over uh the pack opener on mobile um you know whole scene as you can see at three has like this video uh, like this post as well i've been in touch with this dev as you can see and uh as you can see he has said that it will be finished next year and the reason is because one of the devs had to quit midway through or something and uh, those are the small problems that they're facing but actually um you know we are looking at foot dits 23 because uh, foot dits 23 is what uh, they're looking out to build so first up foot dits 22 is going to be released in jan though so as you can see uh, pre-season wait it's in this latest post then yeah there you go our game will be released in pre-season in early january by team of the year and the game will have all the standard modes so this game mode is necessary to get in part 23 and make sure you do sign up for part 22 in jan and make sure you do download it because um if you do uh do that it, the part 22 will be uploaded updated into completely improved part 23 which is pretty much going to be like crazy bits as they're promising and the people who play part 22 which is for this 22 will receive prizes for that season as well so this is quite interesting as well quite exciting so make sure you guys do look out for this one as well in jam okay so the final game is packford and now we have very minimal um you know news as to what happened and uh, that the thing is i'm pretty sure this was removed earlier and they said they will keep me in the loop as to when pack for 22 will be out but right now it looks a bit dicey for them because their game had to be taken down and as you can see this game was again re-uploaded or re-released on 4th august 2021 so yeah i'm not too sure about Packfoot's future but uh if i have any updates on that that will be uh you know given to you guys along with the pack win 22 news Alright guys, so that is going to be it for today's video. If you did find this helpful and informative, uh, make sure you guys do leave a like and subscribe. I'll be bringing more such videos about news and release dates in the near future, so make sure you guys do subscribe for that as well. I'll be seeing you guys real soon with another video. Until then, goodbye.